Hey guys, it's me, Useless Girl, and I'm back with another Horizon Forbidden West playthrough. If you like it, you know what to do. Sorry, my previous video ended so abruptly. My headphone disconnected and then I pushed the wrong button and it stopped the recording, which I did twice. <laughs> so this game really doesn't want us to know what this clone of Elizabeth wants to tell us. Anyways, we continue from there, hopefully without any blunders. If you ruin this site, I may be dead. Be careful when you take on Farsiness. They are ruthless, and they have a Lucia, Artemis, and Apollo now. <gasps> but at least they don't have the Gaia Colonel to march them with. You must succeed. Oh, this was all for nothing. Good luck. And goodbye. So she's... She's still alive. We need to get her back to. Oh no. Oh shit, they can fly. Aloy. Aloy, can, can you hear me through this thing? What's going on, Aaron? Two of those spectral things just fell out of the sky. One of them is heading down towards you, the other one's waiting up here. We're coming up. Stay in cover until I get there. You got it. Get her to cover in that room. Whatever happens, she stays with us. I'll protect her. Oh, God, no. I should prepare before the Spectre gets here. I can't let it get through to Varl and the clone. What, what, what do I do? I'm panicking! I'm panicking! Prepare for battle. Thanks! How do I do it? Oh my god, this wasn't... Nothing, nothing! Seriously! What, 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 what do I do? Metal plate. Okay. I need your weakness. Plasma and acid. Thank you. Thank you! Oh my god! Yeah, it has! Just let me take in some damage! Whoa, my god! Just go! Just go! Just go! I hate it! I hate it! I hate running around! <laughs> I'm panicking! That thing's quick! Yeah, no shit! Get up there! My hands are sweating! Oh my god! Please, 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 please! Quicker! Oh my god, that is strong as hell! Oh, Jesus Christ! Come on! Come on! I'm heading up top. Stay down here with the clone for now. Got it. I'll follow once the coast is clear. <sighs> Jesus. That was scary as shit. I should probably... I love these. I love these arrows. They are so, so good. Notch. Hmm. 
Maybe we could try that out because I learned that skill but never used it before. Gotta get back it... to the top and deal with that other specter. I just hope Aaron stays in cover. Uh, I forgot what I was saying. Their stuff. Has seen a significant improvement decreasing the time between touch ups that commercially available treatments like blah 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 require. As for Malik's team, the latest results from their neuro psychology experiments seem promising and with this supplementary data provided by our Tokyo facility we seem to be closing in on functional first generation implants. Meanwhile our friends in Zurich have sent over their findings on well, mixed results a couple of promising avenues but anything bordering on real digital Transcendence looks to be decades away, if not. Stuff. Give me the stuff. I need this to calm my nerves. My hands are sweating so badly. <laughs> Text mail song. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Priority shift. Oh, as you will undoubtedly have heard by now, we have lost the brightest star among us. Research on echogenesis for the Odyssey was near and dear to Peter, and on behalf of the new High Council, I commend you for all your efforts and the great strides made over the last several years. Yet as we mourn our founder, we must also keep our gaze on the bright future ahead. To that end, we will be shifting project priorities. Over the coming days, you will be briefed on exciting developments in longevity research from our Tokyo and Logos facilities with new assignments to follow. In the meantime, all echogenic chambers should be moved to storage. Refer to your leads with any question. Okay, whatever. So, we should have gone up first. Not down. So I'm gonna do that. Because I need some time to <laughs> face that other specter. This place we looted, yes, but there was another. This one. There's a locked door. Uh huh. This was just another way in. Text mail. Spoon fed. January 18, 2065. Claire, wish you'd been on the call with me with zero down. Whoever negotiated this deal with them was ingenious. A bunch of our old tech collecting dust in storage in exchange for a copy of all human knowledge. Talk about a bargain. 
and the guy heading up the Eleuthia subfunction, Patrick Brockard Plain. You could practi practically see sparkles in his eyes when he was bombarding us with follow up questions on the ectogenic chambers design. It was like we were waving catnip in front of him. Anyway, they are requesting additional material on nutrition delivery. Higher ups gave the go ahead, so send over everything we have. Brother Klein will probably pee his pants in glee then. Okay, this door won't open. But now we have everything explored. I have to go fight the thing. I don't like this, I don't like this, I don't like this. Okay, so... Let's restock. Hunter, go. I have to run ahead a little bit. I have to double notch braced shot. Focus shot. Let's go with a double notch that will fire two arrows here. I have the triple notch which fires three arrows at the same time. I have the high volley which rains down arrows on the enemy. Triple notch. Let's leave it on triple notch. Okay, so notebook. Where was that spectre thing? Ah, there. Okay. So weak to acid and plasma damage. Which means we probably should try out the bolt caster or whatever it's called with the plasma stuff which is this sustain the spread blast this empties the whole clip i think okay Oh, come on. Don't scare me. Yeah, the Spectre's dug its seals in. It's got me pinned down. Hang tight. I'm almost there. Just hurry. Oh, that doesn't sound good. I gotta get to Aaron. Where's the Spectre? I wanna tag it. That's Aaron. Aaron, I'm here. Watch out. That thing's shooting down the center. Stay put. I'll see what I can do. Ah, it's there. The second you need me, I'm there. Oh, Spectre's not budging from that spot. I might be able That's to sneak up on it. If good. I stay on its line of fire. Stay there. Stay there. Okay, so it's Stay 
stay there. Stay there. Stay there. Oh. Oh my god, good. Aloy, she's... Look, I swear I'm not drunk, but... but I didn't <laughs> see a Long story, but it'll have to wait. She needs a healer, but we need to get her back to the base immediately. Right. Yeah. Well, what are we waiting for then? You two go on ahead. I need to take another look at that weapon. If I can figure out how that thing works, maybe the Xenos won't be so invincible after all. Yeah, but where's the machine? I want to loot that. I want to loot that. Thank you. What the hell is that? I should probably pick up a few of these healing flowers. But of course when I need them they are not nowhere to be found. to get the weapon fragment to Gaia to analyze. If we can replicate it, maybe we'll have a way to defeat the Zeniths. I should check on the clone too. Varl, where's our guest? We're in the maintenance corridor below the control room. Okay. So the old ones painted their faces with something called makeup. Like the Karcha. Why? Yeah, it beats me. Probably meant something to them, as it does to my people and the Tanakh. I just think my face says it all as is. That's all. <coughs> that it does. Errand, you okay? Huh? Oh yeah, yeah. I mean, why wouldn't I be? Because there's two of me now. Hey, there's two of you now. Well, yeah. At least you seem to be handling it okay. <sighs> I wouldn't say that exactly, but I'm trying. I was hoping you could help me with something. It's about the Tanakh rebels, and it also has to do with the Osirum. Really? That doesn't sound good. Let me know what I can do to help. I see Varl gave you a focus. Well, it doesn't look as you know, fashionable on me, but by the forge, the things I've been able to see. Granted, a lot of them are bad, you know, the old world ending and such. I still try to wrap my head around most of it, but I never really understood how you were ever able to find my sister back in the Sundu. And now I do, sort of. It makes me feel like I could be useful, you know? It takes some time, but yeah. What else have you been studying with your focus? Yeah, I've been looking into this uh, Vegas place you found. Gaia showed us everything that happened when you went to get that Poseidon thing. I mean, this Moreland guy seems pretty smart. Though, 
Risking the Tanakh clan lands for a light show is a bold move. Maybe I should check up on them at some point. Just in case. Right. Oh my god, so many options. What are you working on with your focus? I'm still figuring out how to read stuff on this thing. Those two lovebirds over there have been giving me a hand. But to be honest, all the little symbols they give me a headache. But I'll get up to speed. I promise. How are you settling in? Yeah, Varl's been helping me get the lay of the land. When he's not getting all tongue-tied. I don't know who makes him more nervous, that Gaia lady or our new Utaru friend. Well, what about the Vanguard? Aren't you supposed to be back east, ordering them around? I sent some of them back to Meridian with a message. I doubt Avad will mind me sticking around to help the savior of Meridian. Hmm. <laughs> Did you speak with Beta at all? She didn't really wake up till we brought her here. And when she did, I, I thought it'd be better if Zoe and Varl took care of her. No use crowding someone when they're in a state. He can be sensible. So Talana came by the base? Yeah, more like rushed through. I was hoping she'd stay for a drink at least. Only Karja I've ever met who's any fun. But it seemed like she had more pressing matters to attend to. I guess you know what we're up against by now. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. When Varl first told me those bastards come from the stars, I thought he'd eaten too many of those medicinal berries. Yeah, but I've gotten used to seeing impossible things, thanks to you. I just wish they weren't always trying to kill us. Yeah, you and me both. May 3rd. <laughs> I discovered an Osiram militant group. They call themselves the Sons of Prometheus. It looks like they're the ones overriding machines for the Tanakh rebels. I thought that was something only you could do. They're familiar with ancient tech, and they're as anti Karja as it gets. So, last year we stopped Durval and his cronies from blowing up Meridian in retribution for the Red Raids. And now you're telling me we have another group of Osiram trying to wipe out the Karja with. With an army of machines and bloodthirsty Tanakh? Pretty much. Oh, well, that's just great! Is there any way you can help me find out who they are? Anything to track them down and stop them? Yeah, I can send out some messages from Chainscrape. Get in touch with my contacts in the claim, see what I can find out. I'd appreciate that. I have to get going. Don't go causing too much trouble. Okay, let's check in with her as well. Aloy, you're back. Yeah, I'm just, uh, checking up on how everyone's doing. You mean, after meeting someone who looks exactly like you, but isn't you, down in the basement? Guess this must be even stranger for you than it is for us, huh? A little. <laughs> Varl said she may be able to help us in our mission, though. Maybe. What else have you been up to? I've been studying Gaia's seedlings, the subfunctions. I wanted to understand why one of them would do what they did to Fa. Imagine my surprise when I looked into this Hephaestus and found out it helped create all machines, our land gods included. In a way, the Utaru owe Hephaestus our whole way of life, as well as our current troubles. That's why we have to make Gaia whole again. Okay, my mom is calling, so I'll be back in the next video. Sorry, goodbye and peace.